Hello there, my name is Patty, and today I'll be watching Legacy Season 4, Episode 14. The episode is called, um, Sometimes the Only Way Out is Through, or something like that. <laughs> just remembered. Excuse the wet hair, I just got back from soccer practice. <laughs> I do not have any time to waste, um, also the camera is not cooperating today. Just ignore it and enjoy this video. Here we are and here we go. Is that the wave rider? Taking sets that already exist so that we do not have to waste our budget on creating new ones? I see what you're doing, CW. I really love this show. <sighs> I cannot take it seriously. I just can't. Yeah, I can't, you can't do it! <laughs> I think Hope's humanity is flickering. We might be able to help nudge it along, like... Thank you, MG, for noticing. Like if maybe she were to get trapped inside the... Uh... Therapy box? <laughs> Camera time! I think this one's broken. I'm a comic. Ooh, they look good. We're here to make amends. With tacos. Tacos are tasty. Tacos are tasty. <sighs> My own design. Is it like the therapy box? It uses algorithmic magic to calculate probabilities. Stop doing math! For like a super accurate D&D campaign. Why is this his entire personality? Give him something else, please. Or actually don't. I, I, I don't want the fairy storyline back. Let him play his game. No, we're in limbo I again. A contract. Stop provoking me! Stop it! We're doing this together. Without any coins, we're gonna get. <laughs> You're trying to get us fired. Girl, do you need a nap? Speed 92. Mine's 94. That's what I'm saying. There's no way he's faster than me. Try me, bitch. And go. I'm the Flash. But um, she's basically uh... human. No. This is my baby. I am? And ain't nobody finna touch me! I know what a god is capable of. Demigod. I'm forbidden from fighting against my family. No test needed. Right, Wayne? That's not my name! And she's basically the perfect fighter. Except for one little thing. Oh god. It, it just looks weird. Is your field of battle. You can't ignore me forever. <laughs> you have to laugh. <laughs> Sorry, but the acting must Her be so. Father Ken. We are collecting H2O actors like Infinity Stones. The woman who plays Aurora is his wife in real life. Ken. I'm a Bobby girl in a Bobby world. Lizzie wouldn't fight against us. Well, she is bound to try it, I think, with the branding, so. My father hated me for that. Ken. <laughs> His name is Ken. <laughs> ben Jen Ken. Wow, we're getting so creative with the names. My father cast me out. All characters on this show have daddy issues. We got all these daddy issues. Daddy issues. Mm, my Mizzy babies. Hey, beautiful. Ah. Aurora kills MG. Oh. This is not what I planned. Well, looks like we're gonna be going to another Lizzie funeral. <gasps> I'm a comic. As soon as Lizzie died, there was simply no move you could make that would lead to victory. Am I the villain? I don't think I'm the villain. <sighs> oh. We got into Why does somebody not know how to flush a toilet after they've had a shit? For me. Well, it was fucking one of you. Disgusting! Our enemy has an enemy. What does that make him? A thief and a bully. A friend. I think we're gonna be friends. You can stay here and suffer if you must. Yeah, sure. That's what friends tell me when they also tell me to stop watching this show. My father attacks them. Their power of love defeats him. They make it out before he strikes. Woo! Yes! That's love, bitch. 
All these past episodes have felt like filler episodes to me. Like not too much is happening. Sure, we're building towards something, but it's not like... I'm missing the stakes. Listen. You smell that shit? If we buy her enough time to turn back to our side, she can siphon a god. That's why she needed to be saved. Imagine we had another siphoner still around. Just imagine. My father promised a boon to whoever defeated Malivor and woke us up. It's interesting, isn't it? So, I can't let anyone set them free. Why are they sitting like... Oh, this is reminding me of some kind of like... One of these intense interviews where it's like, how did that make you feel? Today on an all new Dr. Phil. I'm gonna soften him with my pawns first. <laughs> She's gonna let them all die. The lightning kills Caleb. MG dies. Cleo dies. <laughs> so everybody's dead. <laughs> Alaric next, please. It's the only character we actually want to die. Run it again. Not another one? You never destroyed the key, did you? Major key alert! I definitely couldn't trust myself with that key. Does Ben have the key? I had a half brother. Ben. Connected the two dots. You didn't I'm just gonna scooch in right here if you don't mind. Tell Jesus that the bitch is back. I fucking hate it here. The gods don't forget, oh. like Malivor doesn't affect them. I feel like that's Biggest why she remembers. Or forgetting a spell doesn't work on the gods. I'm so quick. If the key is lost forever, there is no way to raise the gods. <laughs> My laundry is done. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Oh, don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. They all attack. They all die. Kills them all. I feel like she needs her humanity to beat the gods. Probably what will kill the gods is their power of friendship. Yay. God, this is actually something that they would pull off. Need my help yet? Shut up! Cynthia. Shut up, you ugly! We need more cannon fodder. How many students are there at the school? Hope! <laughs> when we're done, okay? You've been running us into the bus saw all day like we're expendable! You kind of are like, no, 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 of course they're not. It ain't worth dying for. Oh, 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 it's affecting her. It was Caleb's right to say that. Um, I think it needed to be said. Are we gonna get her humanity back this episode? No, I don't think so. I, I mean, I know the Michaelsons are coming next episode, so... Oh, we're laying the groundwork. Keep your voice down. For real, I don't want people thinking you're crazy. Alone is the exact way you can't do it. Mm hmm. Get some friends! The weak little girl who was manipulated by two different fake Landons and then couldn't bring herself to kill the real one? <sighs> well, here's the tea. You know, she's self-aware. We love that about her. Daddy? But this time, run it with my humanity on. This is it, people! It's fucking showtime! Let's go! I'd put myself in danger first because I can take it. Yeah. Hope you have to get out of there. No. I don't run. I get back up. Girl boss. <laughs> I'll take the hit for her. The power of friendship. My dad's already back, which means this whole plan is pointless. Mm. Because I won't consider you quitting a betrayal. Can we trust her? I will raise the god of time to get my family back. No, she won't. She will raise Barbie's husband so she gets a favor from the gods. I'll try and stop you. We all will. It's a betrayal. Then I would consider that a betrayal. Oh, tomato, 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 I'm throwing tomato. We attack as one. Win! You succeed! <laughs> you know what's the most exciting thing about winning? It's when you win. I love that feeling! You were pathetic. Little oh. boys were playing war. And you're all gonna die. We got a tribe at Meltdown. What are you all doing? Don't you see I'm about to kill you all? Someone take me out! <laughs> Bro, it hurts really bad. Danielle's acting, top notch. The fact that they all just stood there. I'm pretty sure that if Josie had been there, she would have just put her to sleep. Or legit just hugged her. I miss Josie so much. The therapy box is good as new. I feel like she might actually go into the therapy box next episode and then that will trigger the Michelsons and then her humanity. That no matter what, 
It won't be Lizzie. Oh, are we making a pact? Is Ethan going to die? Wait for another. Clap if you care. Hmm. Hello, Ben. Hi, you got something I need. I brought help. Um, well, then my head hit the wall. Boom. Look, you and MG were right about hope. She's close. What? Who is that? I think now's the opening you've been waiting for. Someone who believes that hope still can be reached. I know someone like that. Bye, Freya. Oh, I'm getting my hopes up. It probably wasn't Josie. I'm not sure. Was it Josie? Was it not? Mm, I don't know what to think. Final thoughts in a second. Okay, where do we start? Honestly, these past few episodes have all felt like filler episodes to me. Like, I know we're getting somewhere and we're building and it's good and all, but like, I don't know. Like, it's been building for too long. I need something to happen. So I'm glad that the Michelsons are coming back. If the Michelsons are back, the chances that Hope's humanity turns back on towards the end of the episode are very high. I really need that to happen because I don't want anyone else to turn her humanity on. I want it to be a family thing. People always tell me like, oh, you could just stop watching. I know, but I got three words for you why, why I can't. And those three words are Danielle Rose Russell. She's always bringing her A-game and you can tell. And that was emotional. And I just know that when her humanity comes back and also when she interacts with the Michaelsons next episode, it's gonna hurt and she's gonna deliver. Storyline for the whole Super Squad. I do think that it's been a constant on this show that the Super Squad is strongest when they're all together. I don't mind it. I just hope they're not making it a cringy thing where it's like the power of friendship saved us all. Um, I do like the idea that Hope needs her humanity um, because it's truly what makes her her. And I like the idea that she needs that especially to, to carry and to lead the Super Squad and um, for the Super Squad to also be um, ready to fight for her and with her. We got some backstory on the gods. Luke Mitchell's now here, obviously. It's gonna be interesting. Like At this point, I just need them to kind of get, get to it, you know? Like I said, it's all a little dragged out and yeah. Um, I'm gonna leave it at this. Thank you for watching and hopefully enjoying this video. I hope I could tickle some smiles out of you today and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. Giving man microphones. My face is all puffy and red from the shower. This is gonna be so great.